use the capillary columns. Now these are the detector types we use. We can use thermal conductivity detector which is non-selective and we can use MSD mass selective detector which is a detector which, which can be tunable for every species. That's why if you have a MSD in your laboratory then it will be very very handy because you can use it in different types of chromatographic separations not one or two types because as we know if we have to go through the HPLC technique we need to have the UV visible detector okay if we had to have the TC, uh, the GC uh, chromatography we need to have the TCD or thermal conductivity detector but if you have uh, the mass selective detector then you can use it for different purposes so this is actual the work of mass mm, uh, selective detector here it is the electron source is coming out from uh, one place and here we have the sample where the sample and electron meets uh, and the beam is released and electron beam is scattered and the beam is cached by a detector sorry beam is caught not cached it is caught by a detector and finally it will feed into a monitor screen and we can uh, we can look for the graph it may a beautiful graph it can make